Now, who do you thank for instilling the sense of fashion in you? Uh, who do I thank, to be honest? Uh, my very good friend Jeremy Langmead, who runs Mr. Porto, um, who's, who's just always encouraged me and uh, inspired me, I suppose. And as the most stylish man, do you have any fashion regrets throughout your life? Absolutely. White <laughs> jeans was a mistake I shan't make again. What kind of jeans? <laughs> White. Oh, white jeans? Okay, well, it's... You don't uh, really suit a Scottish guy that much. Well, it's after Labor Day anyway. We put the white jeans we'll away. Put them away. <laughs> now, I have to give you a huge congratulations. It has been quite a year for you. Congratulations on the Eternals. Super okay. exciting. Got to ask you, how excited are you to, you know, be with Kit Harrington again? Little mini Game of Thrones reunion. Throw to her with Kit again. Throw to her with Gemma Chan and... Angelina Jolie and some I and the whole cast is like an outstanding bunch of actors. And Marvel confirmed that there's going to be a character part of the LGBTQ community. How important is that inclusion? I think it's hugely important just now. Just as like our cast is so diverse that you know that I'm a white male actor that's not in the majority in this cast. We're actually the minority, which is really important in terms of diversity in filmmaking. I think that Marvel are really at the forefront of that. And really quickly, congratulations on Bodyguard nomination. Any update with the season two? Because I am keeping my fingers crossed. Uh, nothing I can talk of right now. Watch the space. Okay, we'll catch you soon. Thank, Thank you. you.